it's open and in today's video we give you guys three different presets for three different bead shapes. This video might be a little bit shorter because we will mostly just use presets in this tutorial but I suggest you watch the whole with anyways because you have to use the presets in a little special way but it's really easy so don't worry I'll show you guys how to do it. But other than that let's get right into the tutorial. So now I'll show you guys how to use the preset B trick. Start off by just going down to the description and in a gold rifle you'll find all the free B trick. Basically download all of them and now I'll show you guys how to use them in DaVinci Resolve because it's a little special way you need to use them in. Basically go to music and find the beat you want to add the beat shake on. So for me it's on this beat. Basically press M on your keyboard to put down the marker. Then turn on this magnet tool and rig in an adjustment clip and make it to so start on the beat. So we we'll just put it down the marker. And one thing that's really important that you don't make it shorter or longer in any shape or form. So if you want to drag it around, drag the whole clip. But basically when you've done this, hover over it, go to the fusion tab, then basically just drag and drop the preset. I took the red beat shake, connect it like this. And you will see that all the keyframes are at the beginning. As you see, all the keyframes are at the beginning. And now actually when you already put it in on your timeline, you can make it shorter from the back, but never from the beginning. And basically, right click into a random cache color bit, and, uh, and it's the same thing you need to do to all of the free beat shakes. But if you enjoyed this video, please consider it. Drop a like and a sub, it really helps me out a lot. And comment tutorial ideas. But see you guys in the next video.